Assalamu alaikum viewers, welcome to my channel Genome you know Wide Study. If you are new on my channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon so you will get the notification of all the new videos. In this tutorial, we will talk about that how we can get the protein sequence and the genomic, uh, sorry, the CDS sequences from our genomic file. For example, you are working in an organism and you have his genomic file but you didn't find his protein or cds sequence file so then you can get easily these two protein and cds sequences files from its genomic file or you are working in a protein family or single protein family not talking about the whole genome of organism and you have the genomic file of that protein family then you can also easily get that protein and cds sequence file from that genomic file how we can get these protein and cds sequences file from that genomic file let's start we will talk about three type of that our genomic sequence one is the our uh, the genomic sequence of our protein family that we are working in uh, any family like uh, our previous video shows that uh, uh, we have worked on the hsp70 protein family for example this is the genomic file of our hsp70 protein family and we want to get the cds and protein sequence file of that hsp70 protein family we use this genomic file if we have a single gene and we have the genome sequence of that single gene and we want to get the cds sequence and the protein sequence of that single gene then we use this file and we have the whole genome file of an organism and we want to get the whole genomes series or protein sequence then we use that whole genome sequence file so for this we first we we need to open the tv tool go to sequence toolkit then orf prediction and then go to complete ORF prediction batch mode when you click on it so here set input FASTA file nucleotide so we first use that protein genomic file of our protein family so we drag it here and here he says that output path that where we save your protein and cds sequences that we generate from that genomic file where we save it so we i give the that this path that i want to save my cds and protein file in this folder so here we give the family give any name you can give family and dot txt so our that two output file that cds and protein sequence file will be saved in txt format so click on start so in a uh, second we have get these two files that this is the our uh, cds file let us start from ATG and that this is a complete CDS file of our protein family. And this is the PEP means protein peptide sequences. So these are the peptide sequence of our that protein family. So in this way you can get a single gene protein and CDS sequence or also the genomic whole organism genome file now we use that single gene file 
or maybe here we have two so okay it will give the two genes protein and cds sequence file and here we modify here gene and start so this is the cds sequence of our that single gene here we have in our input file we have two genes so it gives the cds sequence of our two genes and here the pp file so it's a protein sequence file so in this way you can also use that genome file of your whole organism and you will get the peptide sequence or protein sequence of whole genome and the cds sequence of whole genome so in this way you can use your genomic file to get the protein and cds sequences hopefully it will help you if you have any query please uh, comment like and share thank you